Hi guys, Dino and Underman here from MyGrowiPhone.com and we've got another great review for you today slash hack slash tip. Now I just wanted to show you something that I've managed to do on my iPhone this morning and this is an iPhone 4S. Now I haven't found this but I just wanted to show you a video. The good guys over at iPhone Addict found this tip and it's been shared around the internet. Now I just wanted to bring you a video of uh, how to do this but as you can see I have this application just here as you can probably see this one just here that is called Bluetooth um, and it does take me straight into my Bluetooth menu so there we go and I can turn Bluetooth on and off now you may be thinking that you know it's not any SP toggles or SP settings and no it's not but this is the closest thing that you're gonna find to it on an unjailbroken device and as you know this is an iPhone 4S so this is unjailbroken so to be able to get these um, toggles you need to install an application called iPhone project and that just looks like this one just here there we go iPhone project just here it is available from the App Store for 99 cents or 69 pence here in the UK so let's just zoom out and show you what this application actually does now there's been a lot of talk on the internet at the moment about URL shortcuts for different applications and for settings and this is what this application actually does. So straight away um, here's one that I made but we're going to click just here and reset it and we're going to show you how to set this up. Also in the link below is going to be a link to our website with full instructions on how this application works and how you can set this up for yourself. So go and download Icon Project and it enables you to install um, or set up your own custom icons on your iDevice. So first of all we need to select what this icon is going to look like. So I'm going to set one up just for a contact. So I'm going to set up a contact um, for one for the gadget show because I like to text in to the gadget show when they're running their competition. So we're going to set up the gadget show. I'm going to click mobile and I just want to be able to send them uh, SMS. So we're going to click that. It puts in the number just here and it has called it the gadget show as you can probably tell. Um, so what else I'm going to do, I can actually customise this icon just here. So we're going to customise it with, I'm going to give it a new colour. Um, I like a blue type colour for the gadget show. Um, so I can click a whole load of different colours and then we've got the brightness down at the bottom. I'm going to click that. We're going to give it a bit of a shine like icons are as well. We can give it a custom border so let's give it a white border just there um, and I can give it some text so we're just going to call it gadget show okay mm, not really liking that so let's take that out. Oh we can I can move it up a bit or put it in the middle um, and I quite like this felt marker we can also increase the size as well so I think um, 28 is looking rather good there I'm going to give it a new colour as well so we'll give it that red that's looking quite nice for the gadget show one so this is going to enable me to install a a contact straight on my home screen so we're just going to click create now I'm going to create it now it will upload the icon to their server and then you need to install it um, as kind of a shortcut to your home screen. So we just click here, click add to home screen. Now you do have to wait a little minute before this icon here, you can probably just see it change, turns into the right one and we can click add. And there we go, straight to the gadget show, I can click on it, it will launch my SMS settings and there you go, it will input it straight away. So we're going to cancel out of that. So you might be thinking that's all well and good, but what happens about this Bluetooth icon? Well, I can set up a shortcut straight away to the icon project. So we're just going to get rid of this and I'll show you how to do it. Now we're going to set up a shortcut for, um, let's do one for Wi-Fi. We're going to sort on Wi-Fi. So we're going to be able to toggle Wi-Fi on and off. So I need to go into this select type and I want to select URL home page and there's a small bit of code that I need to put in here which is prefs forward slash sorry prefs colon 
root equals and it is important that you use capitals in the right places um, so it's press colon root equals Wi-Fi Wi-Fi all in caps and then we're going to set up what we want it to look like so if I click here I've got a number of different icons that I can use so for I'm going to give it a little crown type look just there once again I can give it a brightness I'm going to change the background colour um, and Wi-Fi I tend to think of a green colour for Wi-Fi so we're going to make it green done click that back on and there we go I'm going to have it look like that so create icon again create does the it's uploading thing and once again we just need to tap this icon and add home screen it's going to change that icon and I can call it Wi-Fi add and there we go we've got the Wi-Fi toggle so I'm going to move this and I'm also going to put it in this folder here folder I want to call settings and it will take me straight to my Wi-Fi options here that will pick up so I can now toggle that on and off it saves having to go into settings and then general and do certain things so one thing about this you do need to keep the icon project application on your device otherwise these shortcuts that you create will no longer work so that's how to create custom shortcuts on your iPhone 4 iPhone 4s using URL shortcuts hope you've enjoyed this video please give it a comment rate subscribe give it a like as well because that helps promote the video around YouTube and also if you're not subscribed click that button just above I've been D900man and this is how to create custom shortcuts on your iDevice with no jailbreak thanks for watching